Okay guys, today um, I'm going to give you a tutorial on how to create um, proper animation elevators with PowerPoint. Um, this is on Windows 7. I've, um, sorry about I've got the hiccups. Um, well, I'm not using Windows 2007 because my trial ran out ages ago and I forgot to reinstall the 2003 version. So I've just reinstalled Office 2003. And um, so I'm going to have to get used to it again because so it might be a bit interesting this tutorial because I might have to get back used to get used to um, 2003 again because I'm used to 2007. Anyway, so here we go. So first of all, you can, all of these you can edit really. It's just the basic the basics of how to do it. Right. So first of all, the simplest thing, hope, oh, I don't have to, um, is to get a, just a, um, a box um, we need two boxes um, now these will be the doors now we're gonna make this more advanced later on first of all let's go from the basics right we've got two boxes now pretend they're the doors okay the si simplest thing to do is just to get the doors working first so what we're gonna do is we're going to go into cu custom animation we're going to add an effect we're going to do a motion path it's going to be right so the door goes sideways then right to get into custom animation you've just got the boxes from down there this sidebar if it's not open click on the research which is up there click on that then click on the toolbar and change it to custom animation then what you do is you click on the object click add effect motion pass and then you can do right and if you want to make it different size you do draw custom pass and then you click line and you can draw it but you've got to make these the same length without otherwise it just will not be even so um, it takes a while to get it all right but it's really good so I'll just do left and right and now basically when we play it we've got the doors open at a different time so to make them at the same time what we want to do is see here the second one number two rectangle three what you've got to do is you click it says start on click you've got to click start with previous now what will happen is they'll open at the same time right now the next thing we want to do is we want to get the doors together and we want to get the arrows we want to get them going out the right length so drag them together try and make it even on each side so i need to move that back a bit there we go. You see they move out quite far. So what we need to do is, by the way, get rid of the title things because they'll get in the way. Just make it slightly shorter. Uh, oh, whoops. I just went into a clipboard. <laughs> ah, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Okay, so what I need to do is I need to go, oh, it's come back up custom animation and we make the arrow shorter try and make them the same length as I said before and just keep adjusting them as much as you can and there you have your doors so that concludes part one of the tutorial on how to create your own elevators that look real in PowerPoint um, and please watch um, Big Elevator Dude 707, I think that's his name, and um, Marlet 72. Watch their video, watch their animation videos. They're really, really, really good in advance. And um, I did, I did it on my own, and then I realised I saw these guy, guys, PowerPoint things, and I copied from, I copied it from them and just made mine much better. And you'll be able to make ones my style, and you can make them. Mallet 72 and big big do big elevator do 707 star with these tutorials okay that concludes part one so please watch part two bye